volvemos a Entre Todos. Continuando con el protocolo del Septiembre Festival, presentamos a la alcaldesa de Dandenon, la señora Angela Long. And we're going to introduce Councillor Angela Long, Mayor of City of Greater Dandenong. Please give her a big round of applause. Thank you. Thank you very much. First of all, I would like to acknowledge the traditional owners of this land and pay my respects to their elders, both past and present. I would also like to acknowledge Mr. Manguel Santana, President of the Latin American Friendship, Fonda Lachinia of Victoria, the Honourable Heidi Victoria, MLA, Minister for the Arts, the Honourable Bruce Atkins, MLA, President of the Legislative Council. Missing, is it still going? Mrs. Inga Poolich, MLA, President, Parliamentary Secretary, Parliamentary Secretary of Education, representing the Premier today. Miss Judith Grayley, ML, uh, sorry, MP, Parliamentary Secretary to the Leader of the Opposition, Mr. Tamo Liguala, MP, Member for Derriment, Mr. Diego Velasso, Consul General of for Chile in Melbourne, Ms. Rosemary Nuyu, Honorary Consul for Uruguay, Mr. Pedro Pablo Diaz, Chilean Ambassador, my fellow councillors from the city of Greater Danong and also the city of Casey. Also, Mr. Chen Tan, chairperson of the Victorian Multicultural Commission. Distinguished guests, the list is very long, so I'm actually going to close there. Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen. Good afternoon. As mayor of the city of Greater Danong, it is my great pleasure to join with you today to celebrate the 2013 Chilean Latin American September Festival. This annual festival is a highlight on the Greater Danong calendar and attracts thousands of visitors to our community each year. Festivals provide a great opportunity for our city, our residents and our community groups to showcase their rich cultural tapestry. The Chilean Latin American September Festival celebrates Chilean Independence Day and Latin American cultural in certainly no exception. This much loved annual festival offers, offers the chance for the local Latin community to celebrate your rich heritage while giving the broader community an opportunity to learn more about your evolved, vibrant culture. Sharing and embracing different cultures is incredibly important to us in Greater Danong. We are the most multicultural community in Victoria, with over half of our population born overseas, and more than 150 different nations represented. These include our strong and vibrant Latin American communities. You and your forefathers came from a land far away to make your home here in Australia and brought your cuisine, your culture and your beautiful clothing with you. We thank you for sharing your culture with us and helping shape our diverse community. Diversity gives us strength and makes Australia a better place to live. Living together harmoniously in such a vibrant community is something we here in Greater Danlong are very proud of. It is that for that reason that City of Greater Danlong has been pleased to support this festival over many years through our community sponsorship grant. Events like this help us to come together to learn about each other's faiths and traditions and to pr promote cultural understanding and acceptance. It has been my privilege to join you here today for the Chilean Latin American oh, September Festival as we celebrate together. Thank you and enjoy the rest of the festival.
Now we're going to introduce you to Mrs. Inga Belush, Parliamentary Secretary for Education. Thank you very much, and uh, good evening, uh, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Viva la Chile! Could I also acknowledge uh, Mr. Miguel Santana, President of the Latin American Friendship La Fonda La Clinica, and congratulate him on so many years of putting together an amazing festival which seems to just get better and better every year. I know you've had some challenges, but you are an absolute master at it. Well done. Congratulations from everyone. I know he's supported by a very strong team, his executive team, his volunteers, and uh, obviously so many of the performers that we're able to, uh, to enjoy here. So thank you to all of those as well. Councillor Angela Long, the Mayor of the City of Greater Dandenong. City of Greater Dandenong um, have an exceptional track record uh, in terms of their work with multicultural communities. And here is the heart in the southeastern metropolitan region, a region that I have the honour of representing the Victorian Parliament for now 17 years. And having come here as a 10-year-old without any English, also like immigrants, like many of you, I'm very proud to be representing this community in the Victorian Parliament. I'd also like to, rep uh, to acknowledge uh, my parliamentary colleagues, Tel Merlinguila, who himself comes from a Latin American background and will no doubt blitz us all by being able to speak to you in Spanish. Uh, but he's a good colleague and I know how much work he does with the multicultural communities. Uh, I would also like to acknowledge uh, uh, Judith Grayley, member for Narry Warren North, and my very, very good friend, uh, the President of the Upper House, Bruce Atkinson and his wife. Uh, Bruce has had a terrific involvement with multicultural communities and I know that he has, a couple of years ago, led a goodwill mission to Chile. Now, I'm just a bit upset because he didn't invite Telmo and I, but perhaps there are other opportunities. But I know how much, he regard, how much regard he has for this community, which is the reason why, why he's here today. Mr. Uh, we have, uh, of course, His Excellency Mr. Pedro Pablo Diaz, the Ambassador, here today. Very honoured to have you uh, along with your family. Uh, we have our own, Diego Valesco. Well, there aren't two of them, are there? The General Consul of Chile. And I, I gave him a promise last year that I would learn how to dance the cueca, and I didn't. So it's back to the drawing board. And I think uh, the Villa Lobos family will help uh, Councillor Saray and I how to master the art, and next year we promise to do better. Uh, Miss Rosie Marie uh, Nunes, Honorary Consul of Uruguay, Marion Lau and uh, uh, Srinivasan, of course, our uh, 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 multi uh, Multicultural Affairs Commissioners. Did I mention Shintan, the chair who's absolutely everywhere, and of course himself comes from a rich uh, uh, tradition of. Uh, uh, multicultural involvement uh, through his professional life and personal life. I'd also like to acknowledge other councillors. Councillor Maria Sempi, herself drawing on the Italian heritage city of Greater Dandelong. Matthew Kerwin, um, I think he might be an Aussie, he's a blow-in, he's an interloper, but it's all about sharing, caring and loving. And of course we have young Susan Saray, recently elected to the city of Casey, herself from a Chilean heritage. And this is really an example of uh, a, uh, an event that we all come to celebrate and that we, all need, that we all want to embrace. We know Latin American music, everyone loves it. It stirs the soul, it gets everyone up on their feet. Latin American food, romance, the beautiful women. The men aren't too bad either. Uh, my husband isn't here. The soccer players, they have inspired, not just, of course, uh, you know, so many generations. Uh, uh, of, and it's the fastest growing sport in the world, but also in Australia. The round ball, we call it soccer, but of course you know it as football. There are so many th things to cel celebrate. And of course those relationships are forging and getting stronger and stronger between Chile, between other, um, other Latin American uh, countries, between, uh, with Victoria and Australia. And of course we see some of that tal talent coming through. Your talent, your children, aspiring, achieving, being successes. Uh, benefiting from their migration, as well as us, of course, being uh, the beneficiaries. And, and an example of that was recently I heard uh, a, a new talent, a performer, a young girl of Chilean background performing and winning a competition in Casey. And I think that you will hear her um, sing tomorrow, Kiara Villalobos, wonderful, amazing talent. Her mother danced the quicker and got to, and is promised to teach us. Again, uh, uh, Susan Saray. So your children are participating. We have. Um, we have Latin American members of Parliament, we have um, members of, of, of the Australian Parliament married to Chileans, 
you have an amazing ability to integrate and it's something to celebrate. You are a wonderful example of a successful multicultural policy. And uh, uh, as, a, uh, as a result of the deep respect that we have for your community, the Minister for Multicultural Affairs has sent his very uh, profound regrets at not being able to join you here today, as well as the Premier, Dr Dennis Napthine, who sends his greetings, and in particular to note the fact that September is a day, uh, of course, at, um, or the month, 18th of September is the day that we celebrate uh, Chilean independence. But in addition to that, there are others. Mexican Independence Day, marked on the 16th of September. Uh, independence of El Salvador, Costa Rica, Guatemala, Honduras, Nicaragua. And, uh, and of course, they're all on the 15th. So um, it, it has been a wonderful history. You've made a wonderful con contribution, celebrated today, not just about what you bring, but what we share. Congratulations, enjoy it, and viva la Chile. Y nosotros con la excusa de nuestro stand de la 3 Z para conocernos, acercarnos a la gente y a nuestra audiencia también, el, el contacto personal, ¿no? Pero realmente estamos asombrados de cuánta gente nos apoya.